So as most of you guys know, production on Marvel Spider-Man 2 for the PS5 has been pretty quiet for a very long time. We've known this game has been in the works for like probably three or four years. Ever since Miles Morales came out, you know, in 2020, we knew well before then we were going to be getting a sequel to this game anyway. But nevertheless, in like those years... The only thing we've really gotten so far is a small little teaser trailer to kind of, yeah, reaffirm the game is coming, show us that Venom is going to be the villain, this and that, pretty much stuff that we already knew, our first look at Venom, as well as, of course, a couple other things here and there as well, like the confirmation that it will be, you know, releasing in 2023. A couple of other really, really awesome stuff has, of course, come out of this as well. You know, a couple of them, you know, being that not only will Venom be like the villain of the game, but also it looks like Craven the Hunter will be a big villain of this game as well, which is really awesome. We might get to see a lot of those symbiote Craven type of storylines, which could be definitely a really, really awesome thing. But in saying all of this, in the past couple of months, we've actually been getting a couple of new things. For example, there was official confirmation that this game, I believe, will be a PS5 exclusive not so long ago. Not just that, in the last couple of months, we've actually started to see videos of Najee Jeddah and Yuri Lowenthal. Of course, the actors of Miles Morales and Peter Parker actually start to post a bunch more videos of themselves in their motion capturing suit. Whether this is talking to fans or saying a bunch of other random stuff, but nevertheless, I think they're honestly being told to kind of do this because there was a point where we weren't getting any of this at all, meaning that they were told strictly to probably not show anything off. So I think now that we're starting to get a couple more things here and there, I think it's starting to give some sneak peeks, of course, to the fans where they're kind of saying, look, this game is happening. These are these guys in their motion capturing suits and you will be able to see this game very, very soon. This honestly could tell me that with the actors starting to get more involved on social media and post more clips of themselves at work and, you know, showing off what the motion capturing suits and all this type of stuff looks like, this could be a very good indication and sign to me that we could be getting a trailer very, very soon. Now, I do expect this game to probably come out in September or October, something like that, so... We could see a trailer maybe in like March, I think would be the perfect time, but also kind of a sneak peek to say maybe that trailer will be coming out in March would be a really awesome thing. So before I get into any more stuff, here's a couple of the clips that we have been seeing going around of Naji Jetta and Yuri Lowenthal, of course, talking. All right, this is going to be quick because because we're at work, but we want to make sure we get this done. Uh, this is for for Nick from from me and Najee. This is Nick. Where you at, man? A, there, there's there, there's the picture right there. Uh, Naj, why don't you why don't you why don't you sign that bad boy? Let's do the honors. Yeah, do do you do, 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 do so that said, first? Uh, let's see, let's see, let's see. Uh, to my man Nick. There he is. Sorry guys, this is going to be a quick one, but we wanted to make sure oh, yeah. we got we got this on the line. Real quick, in and out. Mhm. Mm <laughs> Here we go. Miles. Mhm. Mm Boom. Oh, yeah, that's, that's right there. That's for that's for Nick. Right? Right? There it is. There it is. All righty, man. Nice. I'm uh here you go. You hold it for me. Okay, I got you. you hold it for me, sir. And just point it in this direction. We don't want him to see any like yeah, see no, 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 we can't stuff. we can't give no secrets. No, no secrets. No. Not right now. Right? It's gonna be too good. It's gonna be way too good. I know. I know. Hope y'all having a good day. It's, uh, what's today, Wednesday? Right? It's something. <laughs> it's something. It's someday. It's someday. Wednesday, and, and, Thursday. And it's fighting uh, land. It's, it's day. You know what I mean? We're just... All right. This is for you, Nick. Nick. There it is. Hope you like it, man. Hope you like it. We'll talk to you soon. Bye, y'all. See you soon. So, yeah, even though they're kind of only interacting with fans, it does still show that this game is still being made somewhat. Again, most of these were about three months or so ago. So I do hope that maybe all of the motion capturing stuff for the time being is maybe being finished and maybe they're just going to completely finish the game off now as we go on with, you know, a couple of the other things that they're probably going to be doing here and there. But I'm just so excited for this game, to be honest, guys. I think it's going to be absolutely awesome. And yeah, I don't feel like we're as far away as what some people have been saying till we get a full release of this game so i'm really excited to see what of course does happen 
I would like to hear your guys' thoughts and opinions down below. Do you guys think we're going to be seeing this Marvel Spider-Man game pretty soon? Or do you think we're going to be getting a trailer maybe in the next couple of months? This and that. Um, my guess is probably going to be March. Of course, I definitely would really like to know. What are your thoughts and opinions on this down below? But now, as I was saying, please make sure to leave a like and subscribe to the channel. Comment your thoughts and opinions down below. And I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.